Hello everybody, this is Theron. Welcome to Minecraft Land Party and Minecraft 1.13. Hello, buddy. Ow. How are you? Hope you're doing good. Hello, everybody. This is Theron. And we are in Minecraft Land Party server. And it is Minecraft 1.13.1. We are running the Spigot server updated this morning they have yet to release a stable release like their you know official stable 1.13 release but four weeks ago they said they would do so in like two to three weeks so it's uh they're a little overdue and i've been doing a lot of testing and everything seems cool so we're gonna test a few things here got the llamas got these guys and like somebody came and cleaned out all my sugar cane which is <clears throat> okay i got plenty of sugar cane yeah they came through and cleared out the sugar cane but they didn't chop this down anyway so we've got uh wait i'm hearing growling oh that's because mr david s pumpkin is right here hi how are you so we are going to grab a couple things and then we are going to go explore Minecraft 1.13, the aquatic update. Okay, for the first time on 1.13, into the nether. Minecraft 1.13 preparation project. There's nothing down here yet. Check back after the 1.13 upgrade. And there's an example of a sign that has some funky characters on it. So I'm going to have to go through and, and probably review and update a lot of signs although I'm seeing fewer that have issues than before but that might be that might be because they made some updates to fix some of those issues and it could be just these signs are newer than I, I don't know so let's get a mine cart cross your fingers and let's go And here we are at the end of the line. Whew. 2500 X. And we're still doing a ton of chunk updates. So I'm going to, oh, yeah, there they keep going. Stop. Do not light this portal. Seriously, stop. I didn't leave supplies out here, which I kind of wish I had. Okay, past me. I'll show you who can light this portal. Me, that's who. Okay, that was kind of dumb. But we are now ready to step through. Um, given that, I'm not entirely positive what's going to be on the other side. Let me get in full armor. Um, which might be a mistake if I need to fly somewhere super quickly, but I can also just step back through the portal. Right? I think so. Okay, here we go. Wow. Look, a dolphin. Okay. This is kind of what I expected because I did this in the test world and this is what happened. Let me get some light going here. And I want to be able to walk around the portal. Hi, Mr. Dolphin. And we will need to figure out... I mean, this will also help us find it again after the fact, I guess. Yeah. Okay. So, we've got a couple things going on here. There could be drowned spawning down there beneath us as we talk. Um, and I've got a couple islands over there which could have beasties spawning on it as we talk. We've got dolphins and fish. Oh, this is super exciting. And you can see kelp and stuff underneath the ground too. Okay, so here's, the, I see some kelp over here. 
let's go over to this island and actually in this case I think flying is probably the easiest choice okay here we go now the swimming mechanics have completely changed oh wow oh oh shoot oh the witch missed but the witch is healing oh okay no 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 if you're gonna explode explode down there and buy the witch oh witch did not miss me that time okay you need to die die witch die there we go oh goodness how bad is it 32 seconds of poison okay eat eat get some regen going I don't want to have to eat one of these golden apples but I can if I need to let's get some things lit up here oh goodness okay point you can stop now poison it's pointless I'm not gonna die the witch is not going to kill me oh Ooh. wow the witch tried to kill me okay okay let me get things lit up a little bit here the sun's about to come up too so oh that's right <laughs> stuff floats now I don't need this witch these this witch detritus but if I wanted it I could get it because it's floating on top of the water all right so this is my home now at least for a little bit we will be using this as a forward base a forward operating base and we will kind of live here for a little bit so I need to remember what the coordinates are <laughs> Uh, let's go over here and look at the portal, which is up in the air over here. Not super convenient. But I can build a bridge over to it. And I can move the portal over here. That would probably work just fine. Okay, so I'm going to take a snapshot. Click. So we are at X, 20,358Z minus 59. Okay. Let me get some things set up. That there looks like it might be a shipwreck to me. So I'm going to put down a bed, and I've, I've got to have a bed in here somewhere, and then we are going to uh, go exploring a little bit. Give me a sec to get set up. So this is a little bit like Skyblock, maybe, only we're surrounded by water, and there's no trees anywhere to be seen here, so I don't have a source of wood. So I brought my own saplings um do i have any bone meal handy no that would have been too smart I mean, i've got bones that probably is enough let's make some bone meal grow tree grow tree grow tree come on you there we um uh okay <laughs> not not awesome tree but you know that's fine now I have plenty of wood, of course, in my ender chest. You know, I've got logs and I've got other stuff that I can make. I have chests and whatnot, but a little source of wood would be nice. And it creates this puzzle, which is kind of cool. Um, oh, and what, what biome am I in here? I am in, <laughs> it's a plains biome. Yeah, it looks totally like plains biome. Okay, so we're gonna take one of these. We're gonna make planks out of it we're gonna make a crafting table we're gonna put down a crafting table right here so we can make stuff and I'm gonna take a couple more of these go plop plop like that and make ourselves a chest and make ourselves a chest and put down the chest here cool so now we can we can stash some of this stuff so we can generate our own podzel now which is kind of nice don't have to go find it in a uh, mega taiga or similar biome okay so we can plant another tree here 
and take these down. Cool. So let's uh, before we swim out to that shipwreck, let's look at advancements. What have, what has changed? These all look the same. Discover time. They've added more biomes, so I'm missing even more biomes now. And look, throw a trident at something. Throwing away your only weapon is not a good idea. It's very, very... Far. Strike a villager with lightning. Oh, dear. Okay. Yeah. Another. I don't see anything new there. Catch a fish, a fish without a fishing rod. Cool. I'll need to do that, too. And wait. I'm still missing an animal to breed? Okay. Okay, very cool. Let's uh, let's go check out the new aquatic features. Oh wow, it's a whole new world down here with this uh, with this kelp. Blub blub blub. Oh, there's a drop off over here. There's a ravine. Okay, so there can be bubble columns to watch out for. Not seeing a ton of tropical fish. There's Oh, there's some right there. Hi, Mr. Dolphin. How are you? You going to give me that Dolphin's Grace stuff? Oh, they, they talk. Um, okay. I thought I saw something over here. That looked like it might be a shipwreck, but maybe I was mistaken. So the swimming mechanics are very different. It's interesting. Um, maybe I was just seeing this underwater ground. Um, so you can move around inside the water. You swim almost as if you're walking, which is kind of what's happening here. Oh. Oh. Or you go into swimming mode. And then when you're in swimming mode, things are things are different. You have to you have better more precise control over up and down. And you can kind of swim at a at a flat level, which is nice. Hi fishies. Wow. Okay, so, oh, drink, breathe, 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 breathe. So, portal. So, I was probably seeing that kind of underground mountain there and thought that that was a structure like a shipwreck. What's going on over there? That looks odd. Could just be fish swimming around something. But let's see what that is. Uh, I did bring some water breathing potions, which I should have on the bar. Do not want to die and lose all my stuff this far out. Although it's right near the potion. Okay, that looks like something there. So let me put this on the bar so I can drink it. Oh. There is a shipwreck. Very nice. So let's see what we got down here. A uh, night vision potion would have been smart too. I get some improved night vision from... Um, from my helmet, from the respiration, but... Okay, let's so let's do this. Down here. Put this right here. Oh. There's a hatch there. There we go. Oh, hatch goes down into the hold. Very nice. Um since this is all wood. There's not much in here. 
Uh, oh. Crap. I keep an eye on the on the water breathing. And put some more glowstone on the bar. Did I just hear a spider? Sound like I did. Okay, what's down here? Yeah, I heard a spider. I wonder where the spider is. I saw that chest. Don't worry. I saw this chest too. So I'm going to put this right here. Where would I put this? Right there's good. Okay. What have I got? Oh, some <laughs> enchanted leather pants. Pumpkins. Now, these pumpkins are new. Um, I These are regular pumpkins. They are not jack-o'-lanterns. Carrots. Poisonous potatoes. I like poisonous potatoes. Don't ask why. Um, they're just, they're like useless things. Oh. Some books, some paper, buried treasure map. Here we go. Bingo. Let's put this up here. All right. So let us, how are we doing on the water breathing? There must be there must be a ca cave nearby where I'm hearing the spiders. And let me put some glowstone up on top here. Feel lucky, whoops, that we haven't seen it drowned yet. But I would like a trident, so okay. There's our portal. Let's go back under the water. Sorry for the noise. It is late September in Los Angeles, and the uh, the temperature outside is still kind of insane. So uh, that's the air conditioning, and I'm not I'm not likely to turn it off because it's uh, it'll get kind of hot in here, and I'll start to have trouble. Hi there. I need to capture some of these fish. Where's the portal? Oh, look. I saw a drowned guy. Okay, this might be dumb, but I want to I want to kill him because he doesn't have a trident, but um but it's a new mob that I haven't killed yet. So let me take care of him. And he drops I've lost my portal. Oh. oh, this guy's got something. Not a trident. What is he carrying there? Is he carrying a fishing pole? You gonna attack me with a fishing pole? Oh, wow. That'd be kind of cool if they actually used those. Or if he dropped it. Okay. Oh, there's my portal. Okay. Very good. Now, I saw something underwater. Um, be nice if you added like a, a treading water sort of thing. Okay, I saw some lights under the water. There's the shipwreck. Maybe that's what I was seeing. Nope, there's something over there. Okay, so we're going to swim. There's zombie flesh from one of these guys that I killed. Let's eat soggy golden out carrots. Ooh. Oh, there's a water co uh, bubble column. And then is that... Okay, so there's a ravine here. And then there, that almost looks like there's a structure in the ravine. Like there's a shipwreck in there. But... Hi, dudes. But I saw something. There was lights. There were... There's looked like there was a small underwater cave with lights. Oh, look, though. I see another shipwreck. And I see another drowned... Oh, and a underwater structure. Oh, cool. Okay, I gotta take care of these guys first. Manage the water breathing. Okay. And put down over here. What kind of range do these guys have? 
And does putting down light help me or hurt me? Okay, and I need to collect some of this kelp. Oh, hello. You come to play? It's my ship, not yours. Finders keepers. Keep away. Okay. Okay, let's see what we got down here. Whoa. How are we doing? We got a minute of water breathing left. We got another potion ready. Let's get down through the hatch and see what we got here. Another chest. Give it a minute to generate. Another buried treasure map. Not bad. Don't really need the feathers and such, but um, put that there. Oh wait. Okay, let's go ahead and drink another potion. Get another one ready on the bar. And put that more glowstone here. Now the poisonous potato, uh, more poisonous potatoes. So it looks like there's there's a relatively small number of loot tables for these chests and the shipwrecks, and uh, poisonous potatoes seem to be pretty common. Okay, let's go down here. Oh, uh, look, sea lanterns. Oh, nice. So you can get sea lanterns outside of an ocean monument now at this point. Nice. Okay, so there's going to be a point here somewhere careful of that and there's probably a chest in here somewhere with presumably better loot let's uh oh I got I got tropical fish I got what looks like the clownfish okay Uh, where? Let's get out my shovel. Oh, look! Found a chest. Oh, and there's some coal. Another buried treasure map. What do I not need? carry around with me. I don't need to carry sand or gravel or some of this stuff. Probably need to dump some of the stuff into my inner chest, but very cool. So we have found buried treasure in the sea. Uh-huh. Let's go get some of that magma, those magma blocks, because that could become useful I know I can make it, but, uh, but you know, there's some of it just right here. So let's go grab, there's another block over here, right? Yeah. They also let out light, which is kind of nice. There's another structure right there. Goodness. Okay. I wonder if the magma blocks have any sort of indication of where the treasure chests are. I guess based on this sample, the answer is no. Another buried treasure map. Uh, I don't need this. And buried measure treasure map. So the treasure map, 996, 994, 995. So I wonder if these are interesting. So I've got four of these now. I hope they don't all point to the same place because the, the Woodland Mansion map and the Ocean Explorer maps are kind of that way. Um, hopefully these point to buried treasure more close to where you are. 
because that would be nice. Okay. Shipwreck. Okay, and hopefully I'm not like thoroughly lost here because I feel like it. Was that coral? How are we on the water breather? We're still breathing underwater. I only have two potions left, although I have stuff to make more. Oh my gosh. Coral blocks! Oh, these are beautiful. And I hate to completely destroy this, but I want some of these. This is a pretty good range. It would be nice if you could craft these out of the coral fans. Oh, look at you. Look at all the fish. Oh, th this is beautiful. Okay. So I'm going to collect a few of the different colors of coral b coral blocks here. And, whoa. What was that? And the fans and all that good stuff. Just so I have them. Uh, give me... I'm going to do this and then come back. Because this will get a little boring. Whew. Okay, I have a potential problem here. So I'm by, I've got, I've got stuff here. I've got kelp and I've got coral and sea pickles and all that good stuff. This is a beach, right? Yeah, this is just a regular beach. Not a warm beach or anything like that, but um, I'm gonna go mine some of this stuff. I'm gonna take some underwater breathing and I want a good collection of stuff before I head back not positive where back is I think it's over that way somewhere but um, honestly I'm I've traveled farther away from the portal than I probably should have but can I get this stuff with oh, that's right that's got to be it's a little tricky now did I get it I saw it float up there it is there's several different types of oops, fan coral, and there's oh, there's different colors, and you can generate some of these if you have coral blocks. Okay, nice. Okay, I'm gonna collect some of these, and I've got, um, and I collect the coral block itself, or what do I need for that? Oh, there it is. Pick it up, okay. All right, I'm gonna collect some stuff here. These sea pickles. New recipes unlocked. And yeah, so I want to collect some of this stuff and then I want to uh, get some fishies. Oh, put these back. And yeah, so let me go on my little shopping spree here and I'll be back in a little while. <laughs> 